everybody and today I am back with mix daily training how is everyone doing and let's go hi karma how are you how is everyone doing okay sound is good karma what's up what is up oh, yeah yesterday after marathon I took a day off because uh, I had chess in my dreams. Okay, it's Monday. Yeah, it's already Monday passed. Already just four days, you know? So it's weekend. So now Joseph was up. Oh, that is drove draws ever drawn drew drawn drawn drawn. Is already playing this for one thousand seventy moves? One thousand one hundred seventy moves. One thousand seventy moves would be fun, but it's a draw, unfortunately. I wanted to last the game to. Blah, blah, blah. I wanted the game to last for five five hundred moves, but. Fortunately, it was 50 move well, most likely another dead draw because it's like two good bots playing when two good bots are playing it's draw They literally have like the same amount of score just one point difference Oh gosh, why is bot chest so boring? Hello panda, um, yeah, this this is just getting ridiculous Please, somebody save me from this. I need somebody to save me from this. Help! It's like so boring. Help! Why it is like begging for a drone? Wow. Leeches bought the recitative 24 7 using Socrates with online books. Play stun and chest 960. Okay. It lost in its entirety, it just lost 22 games. Ah, okay, Joseph. Uh, in its entire career. Uh, which is two months it just lost 22 games drew 26 hundreds even more even more uh, crazy as an anish and then 860 wins um but yeah that's a lot of draws if i'm gonna be honest it's way too many draws Repetition. Oh, I got an open. Thank you, Ferran, 1850, for saving me. Thank you. Simply Divino, wow! With a rate of party of 351. Welcome, Raider. Thank you so much, Divino. Wow, thank you. Welcome, Raiders. How was the stream? Thank you so much. So, yeah, right now I started, uh, I'm playing a game against Life Opponent. It's going to be interesting, a rapid game. Hopefully it's going to be entertaining. Hi, Tony Swagger. Simon Vell, very nice, Divina. Hi, hi, everyone. Hi, I am Rastaman. Hi, Divina. Hi, Juho J. Hi, Tony Swagger. Welcome, Raiders. Hope you are having a fantastic day. Thank you, thank you. Have a good rest. Take a good rest, Divina. Thank you for the raid. Okay, so we are playing a Cosio. Quite interesting. Every message is deleted. Moobot. I mean, I'm sorry. It's all Moobot's fault, guys. I am really sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, go check Divin out. A great, great streamer. Thank you once again for the raid. Um, okay, I think I'm gonna go Bishop B7. <laughs> yeah, raid message got banned. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mubot, Mubot is very, very strict with messages. Thank you for the follow, guys. We have 471 viewers. Wow. So it said it was a rate of 350, but I think Divina rated like. And George, 100 bit. Thank you so, so much. 
Thank you. Thank you, everybody, for the follows. Really appreciate each, each and single one of you. Um, okay. Now, um, I think I'm going to take... Thank you, Juba, for 100 bits. So, knight d4. He's forced to take with a queen, I'm pretty sure. Because if this, c5, bishop e3, b5, and then I think the bishop is stuck. And this, I'm planning to go here, there, and bishop b7. Not c5, because then queen d5. And I'm not in time for c4, because... Wait, what? Am I missing something? Hold on, c5. Bishop moves b5, bishop b3, c4, right? The bishop is stuck, and if queen d5, rook b8, bishop b3, c4. Guys, I may be missing something, but I'm pretty sure he may be blundered. I'm not sure. We'll see. Hey, Manuspa, thank you. Yeah, but c5, b5? Isn't this... Okay, that is interesting. I was reading before he was born. Yeah, that is an interesting decision from him, to say the least. Uh, as we know, if you're up material, you would want to trade it. So, let's trade the bishops. It's a weird decision. Like, why wouldn't you take queen d4? I'm not sure. Okay, uh, bishop f6. Bishop f6 taking this one because it can be a passer for him. And I think taking it will be pretty nice. If bishop c5... Perhaps I'm pro probably I'm gonna take. Thank you for another follow, Predalto. You stay here, guys, on the channel, and hope you have fun. Two points for a knight is fine, especially if you were losing the bishop. Yeah, yeah, it is. But I don't think he was actually losing it. I think if he would take with the queen first, with the idea is then if I go c5, he gets queen d5, and I don't get b5 because my rook hangs. That's the only thing. Rook a2. That's the thing I thought, because otherwise, yeah, of course, if you're losing the piece, two pawns is very good for it. But I'm not, I don't think he was like, he was forced to even go for this line uh, where he sacrifices the piece. I think he was, he was good um, without it. Okay, rook e8 here. Um... Okay, queen c7, attacking the bishop. If the bishop moves, attacking this pawn as well, right? And if he goes b4, I thought maybe I go bishop e5, attacking the h2 pawn. And like h3 or g3, I go d6, attacking the bishop once again. And the bishop moves, then I take c2. That looks good, I think. Yeah, I think so. Because d6 now... He can uh, most likely, I, I think, if I go bishop e5 first, then d6, I should get d6, bishop moves like e3, then I take c2, queens are off the board, and now he just has one pawn. Sure, it's a passed pawn, uh, but I hope I should be able to, to stop it before it promotes to a queen thing that is good for me. Yeah. So this queen c2, he's forced to take. Oh, he mouse slipped. Okay. It was in Farron 18.50. Good game, thank you. Yeah, that was a weird game. This guy is 26.80 and he just blundered a piece. Okay, of course, after queen c2, the game would last longer, but... Yeah, queen c2, I still would be completely winning, though. Okay, d6 was actually a blunder. Oh, guys, look at this. I take, and then if he takes, I take this, and then I get rook e5, and that's made. That's a very... Oh, gosh, my lamp fall. Whoopsie, guys. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, my lamp fall, guys. Be right back, let me fix it. Uh, okay, that was unexpected. Okay, let's see if the lighting is okay. Yeah, it is. Gosh. Uh, <laughs> okay, that was interesting. Um, new lamp tomorrow. <laughs> Hopefully not. Hopefully not. <laughs> yeah, but it was a very nice idea. Bishop g3, and then if he takes, I get rook e5, and that's mate. Okay, d6, stop, which says it's a blunder, but I'm pretty sure it still wins. 
because if you simulate the a variation thank you for follows guys always stay humble 11 and lucy chest life thank you so so much guys um oh firefish bot is losing i think guys or maybe it's not maybe it's bot doing bot stuff but it's interesting yeah but this is a very brilliant very obvious move no but it's not super obvious but it's really a beauty and if queen e2 you go bishop e5 and yeah it's just much winning but in the game it was completely winning i always take humble thank you for the follow yeah so i'm quite happy with the game yeah and as i said guys bishop d4 was a blunder he had to go for queen d4 and then the idea is if c5 queen d5 and b5 doesn't work because my rook hangs on a8 so he has to go like dc i have to go d6 but then bishop b3 and he saves his bishop and if i go b5 pretty much the same thing he gets queen d5 so it was yeah, he blundered, and then uh, there was this very brilliant bishop g3, which I missed, but I was still completely win. But then he blundered mate and I won. Now let's solve puzzles. Okay, material check. We both have five pawns. We both have two rooks. Wait, let me do something. We yeah, both have two rooks. Uh, two rooks, hold on. How do you do green color? Ugh. How do you do green color? Hold on. I'm always confused with colors. Okay, uh, okay, let's be red. Uh, then yellow for my queen somehow and light blue for his queen. So material is equal. F and G for high Biagio, Biagio. yeah. That's an interesting idea, f4. So material is completely equal for both of us. Um, hmm. So Biagio suggests f4. And the idea is if rook h5, yeah, hi, hi, how are you doing? And if rook h5, g4. So I'm forking his, uh, his rook and, oops. Yeah. his rook and queen right by with my pawn if he moves the queen to say to d5 rook uh i think queen c3 g8 should be winning just got home from Oracle. good but tight yeah take take care have a good rest viaggio it's well needed so yes f4 if rook h5 g4 rook h3 i think i'm gonna take h3 right i'm a rook up now and if he takes h3, I just take g takes f, and it's completely, completely winning for me. And if it was or queen e4, queen d5, queen c3 with check, I protect my rook, and I should be winning. So f4, if queen h3, I think queen d4. Oh no, if f4, queen h3, I go queen h3, takes, then I take f takes g, and I'm a healthy rook up, it's winning. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate, beyond you. <laughs> Yikes. Joseph, did you send the message without sending a message? No, you sent this weird thing on my phone. It didn't even show up. No, 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 no. there is. Uh, no, 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 no. I see it. I see it. I see it. <laughs> it's it's invisible but visible at the same time. And the idea is if f4 rook h3. I thought f takes g, but then he gets rook e3, rook f5, he takes f, it's equal. But after rook h3, I get queen d4, e5, fg. His queen hangs. If e d, I go rook f5, g, f, that's winning. And if rook h1, okay, let me show you that. Okay, they didn't make the beauty. Boom, boom. Okay, let me show you an analysis board. So f4, right? If he takes queen h3, then I take take and if takes g and that's game over i'm a rook up game over right if rook g h5 this is this 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 i'm completely winning as well and if you would go here i thought first fg wins but he gets queen of one check and then rook e3 and then it's a drawn rook hand game maybe he's saving the one who is playing on win this pawn falls and then this this rook a4 boom I have two points here, three points here, is even slightly better, and he's the one who's pressing, pressing, right? But, okay, queen h3 loses, well, not loses, but we again get somewhat equal position after this. Queen a3, rook c7, and that is a draw somewhere here. But how I win is that I go queen d4, and after e5 I go f takes g, if this, 
I take a5 and then h3, I'm a rook up. That's over. If queen of one, I go here, e, d, g, h, I'm again a rook up, that's game over. And if it goes rook h1, I go queen g1, takes, takes, I'm again completely winning. And also a beautiful idea is if after rook h1, king h1, queen of one, I don't go king h2, then I lose my queen, I'm dead lost. But I go queen g1, and then, yeah, it's a nice in between, and then I save my queen, and I'm a rook up, and that's game over. So that was a pretty interesting puzzle, and good job, Biagio, for finding that a very, very nice idea. That's obviously what I've seen. No, but that's a very nice idea, yeah. Even if you haven't maybe, maybe, or maybe you have seen it fully, it's a still very nice idea. Yeah, with this instinctual F4, because otherwise... It's pretty much, thank you so, so much for the follow, DB Creech, enjoy stay here and a fun on the channel, uh, very nice find, because otherwise I can do, I can literally do nothing, right, materially sequel, he's even the one who's maybe gonna mate me, uh, but what if we eat the bishop, or what if we eat the bishop, Highlands Playhouse, I think if we do this, quit c3, right, uh, and the idea is if we, if we take the queen no matter with what piece, then rook d1 back rank, and yeah, I was also trying to figure out what happens after this, this rook f7, king e8. Uh, material, I'm a pawn up. I guess I can just go rook f1. But okay, if jokes aside, mm, 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 I'm not so sure. Doesn't look too great. Does it? No, I don't think so. Like rook e7, if king f8, this, king e7, queen f7, king d6, bc, that's winning. But this, 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 king. Ah, uh, maybe rook f8. No, 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 rook here, this, and he doesn't go to e7 because of queen f7, but he goes g7. And takes, no, that's lost, I think. Because my knight hangs, I'm a rook down. And this, 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 bank, back rank is scary. That's why I was thinking maybe I should just go queen f3 with the idea to take f6, right? And if he moves the bishop, it's mate on f7. Maybe that works. But queen f3, there, was, there is rook d6. But then I get my g4. <laughs> so the puzzle continues. And it actually looks like maybe after knight g4, it maybe even ends, I'm not sure. Queen f3. And the idea if it goes like queen c6, I just simply take. And thank you so much for the follow galaxy q and just stay here in the fun. And it doesn't get back right. I think I'm actually going to go queen f3. Yeah, takes, takes. And the idea is if king g7, I get rook f7. King h6, rook b7, that's game over. Nice. That was a nice puzzle. So queen f3, and I simply win the bishop. Back rank ideas don't work for him. That's a nice one. Oh, goodness. That's an interesting puzzle. Uh, let's see. So I have... I have... I have I have three pieces for a rook. But if I do something very slow, he most likely will end, make me like one or two moves. That is quite scary. So, the move candidates are bishop d6, queen d6, and knight f5, right? But, knight f5, then I don't think really, uh, really, gosh, how do you draw arrows? Ah, so many colors. Control. Ah, control, goodness me. Wait, but... I need to figure out. Okay. I don't know how you do, uh, guys. Knight of five? Yeah, that's the thing. Knight of five is... No, that's quite bad arrow. But, okay, let's do... Uh, uh, knight of five. Uh, the problem with knight of five is that, as you can see, he has a queen, and you will simply take, and that's not good. So it's either bishop d6 or queen d6. Um, bishop d6... Both are super interesting. What I don't like about bishop d6, right, is that he gets king e8. And I don't really see how I can continue checking him. I'm not really sure if that's possible. So I think that leaves us with queen d6, if I'm not missing anything. Say he goes king to e8 or king to d8, are his two only options, right? If... 
if, 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 if. I didn't see much difference, to be honest. Uh, huh. Is there see any difference between those two? Hmm, I'm not sure. I really don't see much difference. Okay, after king e8, it feels like the only move is queen e5, but then he gets king f8. So maybe it's not even queen d6. That's what the interesting part is. It most likely is, but it may not be that. Because I'm not sure. Yeah, that's true, maybe. But king e8, where do we go there? So yeah, Alan point out a great idea that after queen d6, there is king d8, and then queen f8, bishop e8, bishop b8 most likely wins, because our knight is a very good piece keeping uh, the control of c3 square, so he doesn't get any rook, c3 or queen, c3 checks, and as we see, if he just takes, we are still two knights up, should be completely winning. But the thing is, is I'm not sure what to play after king e8. Because check he has a bishop e6 or something, right? Maybe possibly we just go knight c5. And then after rook b2 hide on e3, I don't see any checks from him. If queen b2, go king e3, and then knight d3. Oh yeah, I think this one. It wasn't queen d6. Wow, guys, it wasn't even queen d6. What? Excuse me? Wow. So then I just take in a knight c5? What is this puzzle? Okay, guys, if you understood nothing, do not worry at all, because I have zero idea what happened in this puzzle as well. I my eyes itch. No, hold on. It's like, sorry. So, king d8, yes, Alan. Good idea, but should be 8 I'm winning. And if king e8, knight c5 actually loses somehow. Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah, he gets rook b3, then queen e2, and he's winning. Yeah, that was a mess indeed, yeah. But this queen f5, so the, the move I thought would be never correct was correct, takes. Now if king d8, we still go e4, and the idea is that we get bishop d3. This puzzle rating is pending, so nobody knows. Target time 0, zero 9? There is something wrong with Chesscom, I think. Just pretend I didn't see that. Yeah, 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 Alan. Understood, understood. Thank you, Stephen, for 2500 Future Gym, for the full interest and fun. Yeah, so the idea is that after bishop d3, he has no checks. My knight's protecting this. Then, and he has no other checks. Such a blessed check, how are you doing? And the idea, idea is after queen e6, I just simply take, take on a piece up. No, but I love pending ones, but I sometimes hate them also. Because if you get some simple pending ones, they just like mating too, but sometimes they're like this. And the idea is if he takes, I still get bishop d6 and rook in one and winning. So that's quite crazy. Okay, that's nice. Uh, okay. Uh, so. So let's count material. As we can see, we are a healthy rook up. Yeah, very disappointed turn you saga, exactly. I mean I, I should be ashamed of myself. It is very terrible. Um so I have a, a rook and let me count one, two, three, four, five, six points. I have two extra points. Maybe the only hi Darko, how are you doing? Maybe the only uh, worrying thing is that he's written and mate in one in two different ways. The King Charles uh, Cap, thank you so much for the following, just stay here and have fun. So the ideas I get are check, 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 or check, or check. So, hi Charles, how are you doing? So it's one of these five checks. 
I think why distracting me if that's not a spoiler. Yeah, thanks, Zarko. Yeah, I, I mean, why the explanation why I left with the tournament? I could have gotten like 1150 or something points, most likely. Uh, but, but yeah, it was an hour left. And the difference between me and top, uh, top, 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 top 10 was like 60 points for the past two hours. So like I didn't see, and I was already tired. So like I understood, yeah, sure, maybe I can make it, but I didn't really. Hi, tell me how you're doing. Um, and yeah, I left two uh, hour before and Zhigalko uh, just catch me in last 10 seconds. But yeah. It, it, it doesn't change like anything pretty much because uh, you don't get different globes for 11th and 12th place. So literally it's the same globe. Um, so yeah. So yeah, I could have played for for one more hour, but yeah, I didn't really see the point because uh, the difference wasn't really getting smaller. It felt like at one point, like two and a half hours before the tournament, I... I lowered the difference. Yeah, that is nice. Yeah. So like, the thing is, is that I've, I, I made the difference between me and top 10, like 45 points. No, that actually, I think I would be even lower because me and Zerkin, uh, against 2800, they are, I'm not super good at like hyper bullet and stuff. So I don't think it was even a chance. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, and then, yeah, but uh, Zhigalko Zerk a lot, Zerkin and Bullet, yeah, Zerkin and Bullet go into Hyper Bullet, it's cool, but I'm not a fan. <laughs> what is this puzzle? Hello, boys, okay. Nice, nice for Dalto. Hi, Salma, how are you doing? So yeah. I didn't really see the the thing. Yeah, that was nice. Oh, right, 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 right. I forgot. At the end, before like two and a half hours before the end, I picked once again 1339. I had an impressive streak and I picked at 1339. That was pretty nice. Yeah. Yeah, I peaked. That was very nice. There, I, I got this streak. As you can see, this two two four 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 four. I peaked, and then I lost to Schnitters, and then it went like downhill after that. After that, I started tilting. Yeah, Homayon is impressive guy. He played eight hundred nineteen games. Goodness me, 819 games. Oh, but it's actually somewhat sad for him. He was 26 points away. Yeah, sad for him is he was 26 points away from 2k. So, so close yet so far. Wow. But okay, back to the puzzle. I don't I don't think it's queen c4, but last puzzle we didn't think it's knight of 5 either. So that's queen c4, I think. It's either boom, boom, boom. Yeah, 2k would be nice. Eee, what is the difference? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Who played marathons? Eh. Uh, okay, I think Lancer played, right? In, I think, hold on. I think it was. Let me find the previous year in one of his 20 goodness me guys i think we are here for a while aren't we and it's 2020 autumn e, uh, 2021 summer 2021 winter 2021 autumn uh, 2020 summer gosh help me 2020 winter uh 2021 spring and the fun fact would be that he didn't play this 2020 ah no it's spring okay 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 homayon also won it 901 points impressive uh, 
there, 2064 by Elda 64. Elda last last uh, last summer got 2064. Yeah, that's a marvel titles. <laughs> so if you lag out, he has so many trophies that his biophones lag out that you can't even see them for me. That's crazy. Yeah, Elda. Uh, and now let me find 2021. I think it was here, wasn't it? <gasps> the first try! And Ohanan got 17.15. Wow! No, but what I was aiming for... Because look, top 10 two years ago was 11.48, 11.51, right? So, top 10 was quite easy. Oh, nice rate just. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, and then... And then, and then, and then, what? Yeah, so it was 11.41, right? And then, where was it? Was this this one? It's spring. Boom. Yeah. And then l last year, it was like 10.28, 10.52, 10.54. So with my result, this year I would be top 8. So I was aiming for about 11.30, and then this year it was 12.00. It was 1200! It was crazy! Like, yeah, I was hoping that it would be like low, but it was 1200. And yeah. Okay, I don't know, I'll go for intuition. Stupid puzzle. Oh. Queen D2. Ah, and then I stopped mate. Cool. Yeah, very interesting. Um, hi, Bilanchia, how are you doing? Yeah, bullet as well, yeah. It wasn't even harder. That was the, th the weird thing, right? Because last year, it was a hundred points lower than two years ago. Yeah, the, yeah. Rage Dusk, I was thinking that I needed to start playing like two hours earlier. I started playing at 10 CST, CET, right? I think I need to start playing like at 8. Favorite tactic? You mean like tactical pattern or what? What do you mean as favorite tactic? Or tactic in marathon? Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. That it would be like 1100. I would easily get 1100 and yeah. Where is that? You're a rich hunter, right? Yeah, 18 hours on soap is crazy. Oh, guys, the most painful thing uh, uh, is for Lord Axe, who played 356 games, and he ended 501st. He played for like 10 hours, and he ended one place away from the globe. He like literally needed one win, and it would be there. It is so painful for him. <laughs> Yeah, you'll get it at one point. You'll get it. Don't worry. I hope. Yeah, I mean, it's it should you should get it. But yeah, people are crazy. Yeah, windmill is very nice. Uh, more boards. How is this? Oh gosh, it's more board, Sorry, more board. With more board, you can say chess.com. You can say this stacks. More board doesn't like it. Is sorry, sorry, Hunter. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, these are the most painful. Top 2, top 11, top 51, top 101, and top 501. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, top 2 isn't like really painful if there is like at least 300 rating difference, right? Yeah, move on to friendly, yeah. <laughs> if there is like at least 200 point difference between top 2 and top 1, it's not so painful. I think it's somewhat painful for Fritzy, right? Because at the end he was like 14 points away from you. Um, and yeah. At two, two times top two in a row. Okay, that's unfortunate, yeah. Yikes. Let's see what we have in this puzzle. We are rook down. I don't know what the move is. Ah, wait. Bing bang. I don't go queen g4, I go queen h5. So after rookie one, I get queen h2. I also aimed for top 10, 
But yeah, I think I started a little bit too late because I was literally before joining, I was literally watching this line guy join. He started two hours early and he got to top 10, right? Wow, nice. And like if I would start two hours earlier, most likely I would also be in top 10 because in two hours I should get 60 points and 60 points would be just right enough, I think, for top 10. Uh, but I started a little bit too late, two hours late to be exact. So it can be a little bit, it can be too much. Check. Oh, and no, Ooh, that's so tricky. Yeah, but it's fine. At least now I have experience. Because last time in 2021, in 2021, which is this one, I, I, I took too, too big of a break. I wasn't like really, I mean, I've just played, I played 100 games less than this time. And yeah, um, yeah, what to say. I wasn't really like aiming for top 10. This year I was aiming for top 10 so much, but I started two hours late and then I didn't get top 10. Nice product, that's nice. Need to get top 10 all the time to so my profile. Yeah, that's the thing, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that is true. I think you lose more than brain cells. Yeah, that is true because if you get this, like Lancer, right? If you get this smaller globe, it will look so small. That's the thing, right? So maybe it's actually a good tradition for me to always finish at a place 11, guys. What do you think? <laughs> I think we're just gonna take. Yeah, okay, puzzle is over. So my tactic, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've seen. I've seen it, that's painful. So my tactic is to always get top 11 guys in Marathon. <laughs> to, to have this very, very beautiful, uh, the same, the same, uh, not height, yeah, same height of globes. This will be nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Can you two? No, but I still got plus five. It's kindy one, but queen two, okay. Yeah, so... Yeah, he won before this chess peak, right? Ah, if you get more than seven trophies, it will shrink, okay. So... My strategy... Get top ten next time. Get one, uh, one more... Aha, uh -huh, yeah. One more top fifty and stop playing marathons. Or, or always get 5 for first place. <laughs> um, okay. No, but I feel for Lancer. Like, it's cool, but it's also... Oops, I moved my PC while writing, gosh. No, but this, this is... When his actual trophies are not... Uh, are close in his own bullet rating. Yeah. Wait, let's go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. Goodness me. On play chess. Yeah, I think he played a lot of play chess. Guys, we need something legendary. That Lance's trophy will, like, will, like, you will get a new PC so that at the left side right here, right, there will be a continuation of his trophies. <laughs> yeah, that is true, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think like there in Marathon, there is like stage where you're like feeling the power and then like all of a sudden you start tilting. I had something similar, right? When I picked 13, 39, look, this four ended, right? And then I started playing terribly. I was like losing winning positions, like tilting. That was terrible uh, time. Against, yeah, I just played badly there. And like if you play 18 hours, yeah, 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 yeah. I also seen you tilted, right? Because I remember you were like at least twenty nine hundred, and then you tilted quite a lot. Yeah. What do you learn in, in Liches can be considered master level? Ooh, that's a tough question. 
like master level OTB or online master level Utirav. Hi, what's up? <laughs> it's an historical event. <laughs> it is a very painful event. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Tilt is so painful. All it's tilt is always very painful. That's the thing. Because like, I tilt it, and then I even fall out of like three k. Uh, when I lost to bullet train, then I drew Fritz. I was like twenty nine ninety two, but then and then I won against Odegov. I think I got three o one. And then I'm like, oh, well, okay, I'm 3k, I think it's enough to end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but, like, the thing is, I was, like, very, I was very, very consistent. I think from, like, 8CT or something, he was top one, and then Homayon took small breaks, and then he, uh, he take over took over top one and then yeah it is a he yeah but actually against Odegov surprisingly yeah he's very tricky but cross table I I won like six seven in a row against him so I had surprisingly a good score uh that was quite surprising I lost to him my first game and then I won seven in a row he was stilting a lot as well, though. <laughs> nice. He was... Odegov was stilt. Everyone was stilting. Like, the three stages of marathon. Happiness, crushing everybody. Second stage. Losing a bit, but then also getting good stages. And then tilting. Um, so, yeah, then I got back. I beat Odegov. I got to 3k. And then I was like, I had 297 wins and 30 losses. And then I decided to gamble and I got three wins and I ended on 300 wins and 30 losses. Against Fritzi, against Fritzi also surprisingly did super well. Against uh, Fritzi, that's ultra bullet. Against Fritzi, I did six, uh, six, uh, six and a half to one and a half. I surprisingly played pretty well against Fritzi, and what surprised me the most is my score against Homayun. I got, I got, I got eight to one against Homayun. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow, Bobby Fisher sixty five in GST and a fun. Yeah, I got eight to one against Homayun. I was like surprised. I haven't lost a game to him. <laughs> yeah. But the fun fact is I always got dead lost against him. Like, always got dead lost, but I just flagged him. I didn't get G, G, S, G, S, C, F, V, S. There. I played too little. I didn't get G, C, F, C. G, uh, G, S, F, C. V, C. Goodness me, I can't speak. I didn't get him. But, like, how I won most of the games. Look, open ending game against Homayon. Uh, if you... Okay, this game is analyzed, but this game, for example... I am like literally dead lost for whole game. I'm a piece down, but then I just start playing quickly and I just flag him. Yeah, Castor City true, yeah, yeah. I think against us, we were drawing like this every second game we played, right? <laughs> uh, five, six, you're winning. Five, six, you're winning, but in the marathon. In the marathon, it is uh, three and a half to three and a half. Oh, that was a crazy game. You remember this game when we played? When we got this opposite colored bishop? And then I was, the, I was the one who had five seconds versus two. I tried to flag you. And then the side says turned. And then you were the one who's trying to flag me. And then I had less than a second, but 50 move rule. Hi, Larian, what's up? <laughs> Swindle Master, yeah. Uh oh, take be careful, hunter. <laughs> yeah, fifty move rule. <laughs> yeah, fifty move rule is always annoying. But fifty 
Pretty rule move saved me. Yeah, Ration is really great. Yeah, yeah, Taroko. <laughs> yeah, but like, first, first I really wanted to get your bishop, but unfortunately I couldn't. And then I realized, oh goodness me, I'm, I'm, I'm low on time my, myself. We are 2-2-2, two, 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 and I just played this big in each one, this is this. Ah, oh, that was fun. It was fun and scary. Mm. The, you know who was painful against me? This guy. This guy. When I played him, look, three fold repetition. He, no, wait, I was with black, right? He had one second and I had seven or six. And then somehow it was threefold. Just like make any literally different moves, I would flag him. It was all planned. Yeah, yeah. But then I got my bishop moves. I had six seconds versus one, and then it was threefold. It was so painful. <laughs> yeah. I didn't want to get like cocky with bishop sacks, but I, maybe, I, I probably should have. But I tried to be too safe and I got too safe and I lost because I'm being too safe. <laughs> yeah. But let me see how much moves was that. But it was like, it was like 40 moves were played or something. And I, I, I just was too scared of trying to be risky. And I got threefold, unfortunately. What is the move here? Knight of four, knight of or what? Or knight of eight? No, it's not knight of eight because takes, takes, this, this. Rook of eight, it's game over. Um, so it's either most, it's most likely. But the problem was that, yeah, that is true, yeah, yeah. But the problem is that I was a pawn down. The, the, and like I couldn't move the pawn and to get risky to try to make him move right uh, he swore and I had to sack my bishop so I had to gamble and I, I thought I would gamble a little bit later but threefold came in and saved him did it did it did it I think 94 wins though no? oh I was 94 Tomorrow is gonna be, yeah, it was 94. I didn't see difference between 94 and 94. 94. Did I really? I don't know. Yeah, whatever. Um, yeah. Queen e7? No, I think it should be queen d8, right? So you have a g8 check as well. Yeah, but I saw troop g4. I go knight hf3 check, and then I go like rook h7, king h5, uh, king h7, king h, I wasn't sure, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how to help. I didn't really get top 10 trophy. Maybe it's it's a weird one, but maybe you can do leeches Well, you are in first place, so then everybody gets lags, and then leeches crashes. Marathon time runs out. You're top one. I'm in, I'm not sure, but maybe that's an idea. <laughs> uh, Queen D. It's not Queen E seven. I was Queen A. 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 Yeah, okay. I'm not sure how viable it is, but it can work, I think. J just gotta get top one early. And you're chilling. Tomorrow is a nightmare for me. <laughs> yeah. Tomorrow is a nightmare for me. There will be no World Cup. Tomorrow they have a rest day. I'm not sure what to even do. Look up is so exciting. Did you see guys how Anish got knocked out? <laughs> oh, it's the crazy floor. 
Use this in queen g4. Mm -hmm. And I got plus five. And just got knocked out. It was crazy. And right Jabov got knocked out. It's also interesting. Yeah, bishop e3, rook f6. Bishop e3, rook f6. Queen c1, bishop f1. Look, I've seen, I mean, if that's not winning, I don't know what is. It should be. All right, Hunter, I'm going to trust you. Okay, thank you, Hunter. I appreciate it. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, that's five. Just one more. Somehow I'm going to make it through. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, but like, we always, like, me against Hunter, we always get like dead drawn positions. I had a dirty flag, yeah. I remember this game. I just, I don't know what was, I even had four seconds versus two. And then I forgot about the possibility of rookie seven. And I just got flagged. Yeah, yeah, rook f6, then queen e8, here rook e7, rook f7, queen e5, king h6, yes, no check, that should be winning. Like, against Hunter, I, I, like, always got slightly, slightly, like, rook endgames only with four pawns. Uh, that's what I got, oh, four v3. I usually got a slightly better position against Hunter. Uh, yeah, let's try again, look. Only here was 3v3. And then this game. Again, 4v4. I, I hear Hunter outplayed me. They were still at the draw. But I got brutally flagged. <laughs> yeah. And then here our, comes our drawing. Uh, I was winning. How? Okay, somehow I was winning. Ah, queen c4, right. I simplified draw. Then comes another draw. Again, draw. Then how? Ah! My most proudest win ever in of the tournament. Dead is drawing and I just thought it's a queen. <laughs> yeah, we had like a lot of rook and games. Yeah, he offered a draw. I decided to play. That five moves later, he planned a queen. I was happy. <laughs> Yeah, and here was another dead draw against Hunter, just rook endgame. Okay. I was super happy with that win. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, queen <laughs> four. No, but when I was like, when you play queen four, I was like, that's a very, in very interesting move. <laughs> yeah, 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 thank you. We'll never forget it. Yeah, that was a great gift, friendly gift, yeah, yeah. Hi, Zixi, how are you doing? Zixifi, how are you doing? Or oh, Zixify. I guess Zixify, how are you doing? E? Queen B5? How is that King B7? Why do I play rook d? Yeah? Oh, king b7, queen b3. Wow, king, wow. Queen b3, f1, rook f1. That's deep. Yeah, I remember you. Yeah, of course. How are you doing? Long time no see. What's up? Yeah, how are you doing? But yeah, we, we, all, we remember you, Zixify. How are you doing? We should be five. No, but fun fact was like, um, fun fact during marathon, I, in the first half of marathon stream, I thought I wouldn't make it. I don't know, Hunter, how you made it through 18 hours. I was like streaming for one hour 
and I literally thought that my brain will just open through my head, just take all the luggage and just walk out of the room. <laughs> like all my brain cells were leaving me. And I played for like four hours. I don't understand how you played for 18 hours. <laughs> Yeah, I think I had some brain lags for last hour. I got this, I peaked, and then I couldn't really get some great streaks. I got some, but I was already, my, my head was bad. Queen A4. Yeah. Interesting idea. Nice idea, humble. Too many ones. How many ones did you have? Yeah. Were you... Oh gosh! You had so many zeros. Yeah, the, the, the biggest... The big tilt. <laughs> yeah, big, big tilt. Oh gosh. Were you at the end scared that Fritzy will catch you or no? Or you were sure that he wouldn't catch you? I'm not sure what's the difference between BB5 first or Queen A4. Nice, Joseph. Dedication. <laughs> no! 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 Wait, 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 Hunter, Hunter, Hunter. We need, we need uh, CPR. CPR. <laughs> On timeout, Rage Dusk. Boom, okay, Hunter, welcome back. <laughs> Why? Uh, yeah, that's. I'm also not sure. Huh? Wait, what? Ah. You have already jumped a second, yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Mm. Please! Ugh. It's correct, let's go. How is it on F3? Ugh. Okay. Yeah, the, mm. Okay. <laughs> yeah. No, but, like, he was he, like, close? I mean, sure, he was 14 points, sure. But like, was he super close to you, or, or nah? No, but probably like, the scariest game for you was against Fritzi, right? The last game against him 1v1. The people I love the most in Marathon are the people who resign without making a move. These are my like, most favorite people there are you like open a game you literally just read who you're playing against and then boom you won already this is so nice best friends yeah yeah no not actually no I didn't, not my friends at all yeah yeah, yeah. but I, did, I didn't know this guy at all <laughs> this, this guy's at all but okay guys, I'm gonna be gonna be honest. My favorite opening to open and to play against is Mickey. Mickey Shelliker. All like almost always he berserks and when he does, he always goes for a cheapo. And then you know that he'll go for a cheapo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this guy is nice. Great actors, <laughs> yeah. Cheap guy, yeah. <laughs> and you already, I don't know, like, I don't know why he. I remember, wait, there was a one very great example when he actually cheaped me. How do you write his name? Mickey, uh, it's not, not underscore, Mickey. I'm uh, not Mieke Schlecker. I always was reading Mickey Schlecker. I guess I can't. There was a 
Oh, his top 10 finish ruins. Yeah, that's the thing, right? Because <laughs> top 10 finish ruins the other finishes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here. Boom, 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 I was playing with white. He, I don't, he went queen d3, I knew that he would go for some cheapo and I won. Here. Boom, 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 boom. And then d5, queen h2, boom, I won. <laughs> um. Mm, there was one very interesting game against him. Wait. I had one very interesting game against him quite recently. This one. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was a legendary game. So, I forgot who he was. Uh, he cheapoed me. He cheapoed me. Then he offered a draw. And then I declined the draw offer and then I won. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, but the fun fact that I swindled it back. I don't know, I'm going 97. Oh, I'm tilting! Okay, can I please just solve this puzzle and be free? Yeah, now yeah, but there I took, I had a break from bullet. You already took, yeah. <laughs> But I don't want cheap draws, I'm not the cheap all. And I managed to win. <laughs> um, I mean, at all honesty, he more probably should have resigned after he cheap on me. If you offer a draw, he might as well just should have resigned, right? Okay, I think I got it. Bing, bang, bong. Yes, okay, I'm free. Uh, six correct, 25,000 failed. Okay, f nine failed. Yeah, that wasn't good. Okay, now let's play blindfold against stockfish. E. Yeah, like, he, I checked, he is 20. Oh gosh, what happened to my camera? Goodness me. Huh? Hold on, guys. I don't know why I'm using this hand. Okay. Well, that should be better. Uh, sorry, my bad. Okay, let me close some tabs. I uh, like. I don't know how he even has such such high rating, right? Twenty four hundred. It would feels like just cheapos. I think it's 2100 in blitz. So cheapos don't work there. Now, Joseph, who is it? Yeah, blindfolded setup. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because like before I was playing blindfolded, but then like there was no board, so it was trouble, right? Nobody would see. Yeah, it's truly. He played like 125,000 games. If I would take a guess, I think like a hundred thousand of them were just cheapos, right? <laughs> Most likely. He just went for a cheap one and yeah. Life of Marathon. Nah. No, 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 no. I've already lost plenty of brain cells this marathon. I think I need the rest. To, to leave. Hold on, I don't know how I forgot the position. Eh. Wait, so I have pawn. I did. I haven't played B3, right? Okay, yeah, I remember the position now. Okay, I think I'm just gonna take and like rook d1 b3. Because we know against Sockfish level 7 and against Komodo, 
What is bishop g4, if you may, if I may ask? My knight's here, right? Not sure. Ah, yeah, that is true. True, true, true. Okay. Guys, I have an announcement to make. When I'll win a marathon, I'm going to switch to dark mode forever. Hi, Windy, what's up? The good thing is that I'll never win a marathon, so I'll never get to dark mode. <laughs> Yeah, that is true. Yay, handshake agreement! Do -do 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 -do. I didn't even have to do anything. <laughs> no, I'll check it, I'll check it. I'll check your page, uh, Hunter, with dark mode. But yeah, for I'll go to dark mode forever. But like, what's funny with this, like, I have Discord on dark mode. Because, like, when I s use light mode, I think I'm gonna throw up or something. It paints me in light mode. But leeches, it's it's not bad in dark mode. It doesn't doesn't go that far to, just to throw it up. But, like, uh, I love light mode leeches. On c5. But, Josef. Yeah. I don't know. There is something wrong with me, that's, I know, but, uh, that's how I am. But Josef, how dare you forget that I am Stockfish's son? <laughs> Many people call me Stockfish's son. For the eyes, yeah. But the light mode is generally better for leeches. That's so controversial. Probably half of the people left this stream after that, what I said. I see giving a point. And also, I love people in marathons who zerg. And I don't zerg back. It's pretty much a free win. Um, I know that's evil, but... Wait, am I losing this? I thought he had e4. No, but okay, I have bishop d7 always. I can't lose that. I hope. Or maybe I should play f3, e4, just in case. Or king d3. Da -da 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 nah. Why do you observe? Why am I too slow? That's the thing, you know? Because, like, half, half of bulleters would beat me in ultra bullet because like fritzy crushed me in ultra bullet i'm sure you will crush me as well hunter i'm very bad at like quick stuff yeah i'm not super big fan of like fast attempt controls in a minute i think the minute is I'm fast, but there are people who are much faster than me. And usually when they zerg, they are quite fast, right? Yeah, I'm trying to focus more on be playing better chess than on playing quicker, yeah. on what it's still a draw but now my dream of grinding this for 150 moves will come to rule i don't know why he's doing this to himself no hunter what happened hunter doesn't link 
things. <laughs> oh, Hunter. Mubot doesn't like anything pretty much, I'm sorry. Mubot is a very strict guy. Yeah, Joseph, true. Mm -hmm. At least not being threefold. I'm open hates everyone, to be honest. Because, like, you can't even write chess.com with Smoobot. If you write chess.com with Smoobot, time out. Boom. <laughs> As we call it, the chesscom trap. If you write chess.com, then only chess.org, I'm pretty sure even you are timed out. Oh, it worked. Okay, guys, we found a hack how to write chesscom. Without actually writing chesscom. Okay, at least there will be no repetition. Okay, da 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 da. Check. Change. Da 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 da. Oh my goodness! I thought was this guy stupid, but it's a stalemate. Wow, that's nasty. Yeah, yeah, Joseph. Hold on, when was the last time? Oh, I still have. I move pawn and move sixty nine, so I still have plenty of moves. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, bishop g six. I was like, what is wrong with this guy? Slash stockfish, as he likes to say, it's all calculated. Yeah, 69, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, if my mass isn't terrible, 69 plus 50 is 119, right? So you should move so pawn relatively soon. Can you please go c7? You ask and you shall receive, I guess. Boom. Okay. <laughs> okay, now the entertainment comes. Now the entertaining entertainment comes. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, let's see. One move, move 150 soon. Moment of truth. I wanted to know the answer to. For about six months, I think, or something. He... That's how you crush stockfish. That's how you crush stockfish, guys. That is how you do it. <laughs> I still haven't fixed that after like five years. After five years, it still isn't. Wait, I was winning. Ah, so it's like B4. Okay. I, I have. Ugh. I had B4 breaks. Well, I'm too bad at chess. No, Hunter! Stopfish, it's, it's, it's the. I think a bug or something. On timeout. Uh, yeah. One for my, oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so, wait, what happened here? Ah, so I could win. Huh? How? How? 
Uh, Akin F7. Wow, okay, that's some next level stuff. So one L5 for me and one L5 for him. Uh, okay, let me turn off Leech's TV. Why is Cam so low? Oh, let's see, this is better. Uh, King C6, only move. Yeah. Stupid and just to crochet, yeah. That's how you do it. Okay, B4, but B4 is hard to find. E6. Yeah, now E6 does. Yeah, okay, whatever. Okay, and for him, just literally, literally, literally go here. B4. Here, just prevent bishop, uh, uh, not bishop, pawn before. Okay, nice. Now let's go profile, let's analyze against life open and lens the chain. Did I turn off? Yeah, okay, as I promised to Hunter. Hold on. Uh, background dark. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. This is nice. Yeah. No, but just for this. No, no, no. Yeah. In dark mode, they glow. That that makes sense. It's so much better. Oh, that's so much better. Oh, beautiful. What is going on with this little thingy? No, but this this unbeatable. Unbeatable. Thank you for welcoming me. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Background device theme. Ah, okay, what? Picture. Yeah, th this one. Oh, this one. I don't know. Well, that's not a bad one. So when you, you're playing, you're looking at the house. Interesting. Background. Oh, this looks nice. No. Light. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me let, let me watch in my miserable three marathons. Oh, that's not bad. It's just not too bad. Yeah, that's nice when they... Wait, does it feel like they are more detailed, the trophies? Not sure. No, okay, it's probably illusion. Yeah, I kill her. Yeah, exactly. You're focusing on the game and then boom, you you accidentally distract yourself. Okay, let's download. Yeah, so against life open and okay, castle was in the next year to take 94, then c5. Here to play 95 and then you go queen d4. Yeah, dark is cool, sure, but I like light as well. Okay, yeah, there was this brilliant bishop g3 sack. And the idea is if he takes a GM winning, so I play d6, which was a blunder stock wishes, but this, this, and my open mouse slipped, otherwise, I still would be completely winning. Squincy to this, it's a winning end game. And this game, Ferran 1850. Oh, wait, I downloaded. Ah. There's Mubot. Mubot? Mubot? Uh, Hunter, be careful. Mubot is a ninja, it's a silent ninja. Whenever you are not waiting for him, boom in your bed. <laughs> so you better be careful. Okay. Yeah, so this first was an inaccuracy I had to take. Boom, b5, bishop b3, bishop b7. Sure, but like, like it didn't castle. All right, yeah, I've seen this variation. Bishop d6, knight is really slightly better, but it's fine. But like, this is more exciting. Knight is is an inaccuracy for me. The only move to get advantage is knight f5, but still I go here, knight a3. Knight g3 is slightly better, but it's still a good position. Yeah, this is chess base, yeah. Bishop e3. Okay, castle. Okay, here castle is an inaccuracy I should take. Takes here, boom. Here, here, 
castles, bishop e3, then I get d6, hold on, let me, then I get bishop e6, e b5, and that's equal. Okay, bishop e3 was an inaccuracy for me, I may again have to go for knight f5. Here, here, bishop here, 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 queen g4, and it would be better. Yeah, he has some attack, but still it's hard. So that's just by 17. 94, yeah, and this was a big blunder. He had to go for queen d4, c5, this, d6, bishop b3, rook b8, a4, b5, and that would be queen d2 would be equal because then he just blundered c5, b5, bishop a6, straight to the bishops, one a pawn, this, 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 this. This was a blunder, so precious. Yeah, there was brilliant bishop d3, but you see this, oops, here, here, I'm completely winning. Uh, okay, bishop e3, this, this, and that was a blunder. He had to go for queen c2, mm, boom, 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 boom. Uh, b5, rookie 2, I still would be completely win, but yeah, some chance for him, but after queen g2. Queen c1 was a mostly because queen g2 just made it. Northern Inferno, 1850. Good game. Good game. So yeah, guys, that was lots of fun. Very fun stream. Hope you loved it as well. Thank you once again so much to Simply the Winner for a rate of party of 351 member of viewers. Uh, even though after that we got like, I totally do know. I'll end the stream unfortunately, sorry. 351 member uh, viewers, but then we also got like 500 or something. So I think, yeah, 500 viewer rate. Thank you so, so much, Divina. Thank you, Hoji. 100 bits. Thank you to everybody also for following. And yeah, everybody, I'm gonna end the stream. Really appreciate each, thing, and each and single one of you. For watching, I'm gonna rate Anna Crumbling. Uh, take care, everybody. Bye, Karma. Bye, Totally Journal. Bye, Joseph Eximen. Bye, Rage Hunter. Bye, a Sword Dex. Bye, bye, Divina. Bye, B4 Queen. Bye, Telemus. Bye. Bye, 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 everybody who was here hope you had fun take care to blair chick bye bye everybody it was a nice stream nice game and life open and broke stockfish and good puzzle solving take care everybody and i'm gonna see you all tomorrow most likely entitled tuesday by the way i forgot to plug my discord don't forget to join the discord to know me some well stream and well stream and thanks everybody for watching and i'm gonna see you all tomorrow take care everybody and bye bye